welcome back to my channel. My name is Ritika. Welcome to Bianco. What's up? What's going on? So today we are going to be doing a hair styling video after such a long time. Today we are going to see three different hairstyles. One is the straight smooth hair. The second one is the classic curl, and the third one is the beachy wave, which is my personal favorite. And all of these hairstyles, I'm going to be showing you how to achieve it with the Dyson Air Wrap. Now let me tell you, this is not a sponsored video. These are my thoughts. These are my opinions. I did receive the machine, but this is how I have been using it. So let's quickly get started. So firstly, let me tell you that I know that this Dyson Air Wrap is expensive, so it's not a compulsion. If you think that you're gonna use the Dyson Air Wrap like constantly and it's gonna be worth it, only then go ahead and buy. It's completely your choice. No one is forcing you here. If you feel that it is gonna be useful to you, only then buy it and. I have the complete Dyson Air Wrap, and you can choose what settings and what uh, tools you need for your hair type. So let me tell you uh, what all is there in this particular kit. So this particular Air Wrap kit comes with a lot of different attachments. The first attachment is the round volumizing brush. Now this helps in giving you a lot of volume and body to your hair. So the next attachment is the firm smoothing brush. This helps you get that smooth looking straight hair, which cancels out your frizz and flyaways and all of that and then comes the soft smoothing brush now this helps you give that very smooth blow dried effect and this is mainly for fine hair then there's a 30mm barrel now this particular barrel helps you achieve that voluminous curls and waves and then comes a 40mm barrel now this helps you achieve the loose curls and waves it gives you that very salon like blow dried effect then it comes with a pre-styling dryer which is very very useful before going it with any of the other attachments. So with the Dyson I have figured out that when my hair is 90% dry the style sits on my hair way better. If it's completely dry and then you style it it's gonna just last you for like a couple of hours. Okay so the first thing that I'm gonna do is I'm gonna dry my hair and I'm gonna do that by using the pre-styling dryer. I'm just gonna attach this and I'm gonna keep the heat on medium and I'm gonna keep the fan on full. So there are three settings here. This is the lowest heat, medium heat and the highest heat and then fan settings one two three and this is how your dry oh my god the dryer starts and if you push it up it gives you that cold shot also make sure that your roots are completely dry otherwise the style is gonna just die down Okay, so for uh, achieving that smooth straight hair, I like to use the firm smoothing attachment because this actually makes my frizz, frizz also go away. Now I'm going to use the same setting because I'm going to get very close to my roots so I don't want too much heat. So I'm keeping the heat at a medium. So one more thing about this particular barrel is that the brush bristles move in particular directions and in the direction it moves, the air flows in that direction. So the air comes out from these ducts. So when it moves in this direction, the air is coming out this way. When it's in this direction, the air is coming out that way. So when I am actually smoothing it down, the air is moving in the downward direction, taming my frizz. I am going to place it down and then pull it down. And you want to make sure that you're going slowly, not too fast. I've been going a couple of times.
that's how you get straight hair. Now let's do the top section. Cool shot so that it dies down, it cools down. So now what I like to also do is just take this round volumizing brush and I'm gonna give myself a little bit of volume right here. I'm just gonna take this attachment and I'm just gonna take my hair right at the crown section right here. Okay. and then I'm gonna take this and start wrapping my hair up so what this is gonna do is it's gonna give me volume at my crown you see that? just a little not too much because my I have less hair so I like to give myself a little bit of body right here so now we're gonna move on to the classic curls and for that I'm gonna be using the 40 mm barrels now if you see these barrels you will see directions on this so this particular barrel will help your hair curl in this direction so you want your curls to be away from your face not towards your face so this one is going to be used on the right hand side and this as you can see the direction is in this direction so your hair will curl in this direction so this will be on the left hand side so firstly what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to wet my hair because it's not going to work if my hair is not wet so I'm just spraying my hair with some water so now what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna take one section of my hair like one half inch of a section actually if you take too much bunch of hair it won't curl and you're gonna hold it somewhere here leaving this much portion of your hair open and then I'm gonna start the machine place it here and you will see that it automatically wraps and then just take the machine and I'm gonna let this be on my hair for like 10 seconds and then I'm gonna give it a cool shot for like 5 seconds and then I'm gonna release the balls so yeah it does get pretty hot okay now I'm gonna give the cool shot yeah and release I'm gonna shut the machine and then release and you see this is how beautifully wavy loose curls you get third hairstyle that's the beachy waves yesterday is another day I had to stop filming that day because I had some short circuit problems so I just washed my hair I'm gonna dry my hair first like 90% dry and then we are gonna move on to how to achieve peachy waves 
So for the beachy waves, I'm actually going to use the 30 mm barrel. Now the key to achieving beachy waves is you're actually going to use this as a wand, like a proper curling wand. You're going to take your hair and curl it on the wand just like that. I never knew you could do that with the Dyson, but yes, you can, and you can achieve beachy waves. Like you guys saw that there are directions in which the hair curls. The wand that we used on the left hand side is going to be used on the right hand side, and the wand that we used on the right hand side is going to be used on the left hand side. Curl in this particular direction, the outward direction. So this is going to be used to curl our hair on the left hand side. I'm going to keep the setting on the highest. And I'm going to take like the smooth section of my hair and I'm going to curl it just like that. And leave it. Do you see that? That's the wave that we are looking for. That's how you get the curly beachy waves. I have got the beachy curls. I'm just gonna open it up first. So yeah guys, this is how I achieve beachy waves using the Dyson Airwrap 30mm barrel. And this particular hairstyle lasts me for around uh, the entire day and the waves sort of like die down a little bit but then you still have that very beautiful beachy wave to it similarly to the classic curls they die down a little bit but you still have that beautiful uh, body to your hair so yeah that's it let me know uh, what you guys think and if you all want to see any hairstyles Using the Dyson, let me know in the comment section below and also let me know which was your favorite hairstyle. According to me, I love the beachy waves, I even love the classic curls. They both are very different but I absolutely love both of them. So yeah, that's it. Now I'm gonna go and I'll see y'all in my next video very soon. Until then, bye!